Oh boy, it'll be sunny tomorrow. Wouldn't it be nice to have a sunny day in this goddamn summer? I, uh, not today, though. Let's talk corn. It's an unusual crop because it lasts for two seasons. That's right. Well, most crops die when the season changes. Corn lives on. <laughs> you can grow it in both summer and fall. Now get out there and plant some corn. I don't want to. I don't want to. Why do I feel like rain would kill it? I don't, I don't know why I feel like rain kills corn. I don't imagine... Rain on a farm and corn being grown there at the same time. In my brain, that's an image that does not exist. Hey, what's going on, everybody? You can call me Snippy. And welcome back to another uh, episode of Stardew Valley. I've had a long day today, so... Thankfully, I can... Oh, that's a large egg! Jerry, Jerry, that's a large egg! See, the chickens are so happy. They're... Oh, look at that. It's an uncommonly large brown egg. And I need that for... I need that four. I need that four. I need that four. This! And Terry needs to give one as well. And then I need other animals. This is gonna take a while, uh, but that's fine. It's all okay. That means I can't use the mayonnaise either. Oh man, you're eating into my profit margins. Okay. So, it's raining again. You know exactly what that means. Yeah, I can't avoid it, can I? Time to fish! Hey there, Clint, old pal, old buddy. I have four geodes for you to break. What the hell is that? Is that marshmallows? It's a lunarite. That sounds even more fucked up. Iron, stone, and a frozen tear. Okay, I'll just have these. Ooh, I'll take that. Alright, I don't know if these are that good. I'm gonna be honest. I feel like they're not that good. All right, better yet, buddy, I want a copper axe. All right, so we don't have an axe for a bit, but that's okay. We don't really need it that bad anyway. I can also give Gunther this Lunarite, because I don't even freaking know what this freaking is. Hey, buddy. Here you go. It's a white rock, and it's apparently he doesn't even reward me for it, and it was pointless. Wait, do I have any new lost books in here? That'd be nice. I do! Let's read. An old farmer's journal. I've been here over a year now, and I've started to make friends with the local townspeople. It sure feels great. And they're sending me gif gif gifts and secret family recipes in the mail, too. That's really helpful. So, being friends with people is very helpful. Hmm. But what about the Joja Cola membership? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I would never. Time to do the one thing that you do when it rains in this game. Or rather, the one thing that I do if my, uh... God damn it, if my skills is anything to go off of. Oh boy, maybe I do this too much. Nonsense. There's no such thing. I will not say no to a free spinner refill, especially since mine literally just broke. Wow, what are the odds of that happening? That's pretty good lucky, actually. Oh, there's level 9 fishing for you. Oh, wait, did I get an- No, that is the tuna. And then I got some bait. Oh, I don't have room for anything. Ah. Uh, 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 this isn't fair. Uh, bye, and... Bye-bye. Time to sell. Hello, Willie. I don't have a topaz for you. Not yet, my friend. Maybe one day. Do I need any of this? No. Buy. Sell. Buy. Sell. Sell. Actually, it's all sell. I don't buy anything. I sell it all. Tuna bait. Hmm. That's kind of nice. But I don't need nothing. None of your stuff. Did I unlock anything new in here? Whoa, I got a slime! I got, oh my god, I got a flippy fishing bobber. Oh my god, that's amazing. Oh, it's green! Oh, that's so beautiful. All right, it's the best one in the whole game. You know, tuna are like, they're pretty, they're pretty fast, right? Pretty hard to get. I, I imagine tuna would be a really common, easy fish to get because people eat it so much. And like, they make cat food out of it and like pet food or whatever and... And there's a lot of tuna sandwiches. I don't- I never- I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I've ever eaten tuna before in my life. And I've seen a lot of tuna sandwiches. People I know I eat them all the time, but I've never had one in my life. And I don't know why. I don't know why that is. But I've never had it. 
in my mind, it is just like cat food. <laughs> I don't know why. It's because I've only ever fed it to cats. I've never had any myself. I, I gotta say though, at one point I was tempted, like people eat tuna. And I was tempted to eat some of that uh, canned tuna that we usually just give our cats. I was tempted to try that one point because I'm like, I want to try it. This is, this is tuna, but I never did because I didn't know how to open the can. Now I know how to open them, but uh, I don't think I want to do that because I don't know if that tuna is... I just, I just, it's in my, in my brain, it's cat food. In my brain, it's cat food. It just is. It's not, it's tuna. It's just fish, right? It's meat. It's not cat food. It's not meant to be only for them or anything. It's not like, it's not like it's, you know, hard food or anything. It's not like it's, like it's a little cat, cat food in a bowl. It's, it's just like a fish, right? But in my brain, it's still cat food. So I just don't want to eat it. I just don't want to. I don't know if my brain extends that to the rest of tuna in general or not. I have no idea. But I just look at it and I'm like, that's not for me to eat. That's all. That's all. That's, that's, my, that's my story. Oh, an iridium tuna. Would you look at that? That's pretty good. That's definitely not bad. And this is my last fish because apparently I'm out of energy. Also, my tackle and bait wore off. Even the tackle that I literally just attached. Ah, what a shame. What is this thing? Why are you moving so much, huh? Why are you so fast? Who do you think you are? Who do you think you're up against? It's just a flounder. It's just a flounder. Let's get out of here. Uh, I gotta sell some stuff. And I'll put stuff in the box. I gotta put some stuff in the, uh, in the whatchamacallit as well. The community center. These three. These three things must go to the community center. Mmm, nothing. Man, do they nerf trash cans or what? Hold on, I at least have to stop in and say, Happy birthday, Gus! I don't think he knows that it's even his birthday. Uh, if only I had something good to give him. I don't think he'd like anything. Actually, I think he might like eggs, but I can't give him this one. Would he get mad if I gave him a fish? I mean, he can cook the fish, right? He's... Uh, I want to give him a birthday gift, but I really don't know what to give him. Whoa! He's selling complete breakfasts. Those are pretty cool. That really sounds like a top tier item. The complete breakfast. I mean, plus two farming and some energy is pretty good. Pretty good, actually. But it ain't no Peppa Papas. Hey, Abigail! Hey, how you doing? And just like that, everything's back to normal. It's like magic. Oh yeah, the, the whole rain thing, right? Hey, I got this for you. Ah, it's just my color. Thanks, Snippy. She's red now. Hey, <laughs> cool. I gave a gift to a girl, and now I'm gonna give a gift to the, uh, who knows who? The, uh, unknown almighty. Alright, let me see. What do we got here? Nothing. Uh, what else? Where do I need to put these? The egg and stuff. Oh, I bet... I bet one of these needs it too, huh? Separately. Maybe? Maybe not? I keep forgetting... Wait, Nautilus shell. I have a Nautilus fossil. Okay. Uh, oh, I need a chub. Oh, I needed a frozen geo- Oh, wait, I was almost done with this. Damn it. I didn't even notice. Mystical unknown. I'm here to bring you that which you have asked me to bring. No matter what happens, this is this is for the sake of, of, of all that you all that is holy in this world. All right, I will have this done as long as I, as soon as I set up some sap uh, tree sap sappers. What are they called? Tappers. Some tappers. They're actually really cheap. I need to set up a tree farm. Oh man! All right, actually, you know what? Let's do that right now. It's it's not that hard. It's pretty simple. I think the hardest part about it is just remembering to do it earlier in the game. <laughs> okay, so there's unfortunate things. Uh, one and two. One, I don't have an axe. Two being I don't have energy. Uh, and also, I don't really want to plant new trees yet. Uh, because it'll just take a while. So, for now, we're going to put a tapper there. 
We're gonna put a tapper here, and we're gonna put a tapper here. So this is, I think this is an oak tree, I think this is a maple tree, I think this is a pine tree, obviously. So that will create one of every every kind of the stuffs that I need for various, various things. I just need to remember to go check on that every now and then, is the, is the real, the real deal issue. Also, I have a topaz for Willy, so all I gotta do is go bring it to him tomorrow, and we are home free, baby. Uh, I do need to get my axe back soon, but until then... Let's go, go to the next day. Shit, don't cheese in my bed. There you go. Alright, level 9 fishing, seafoam pudding, and a magnet. I am ready for a sunny day in summer. I know, I know. It's it's a mind-boggling concept that it's literally been raining five out of the seven days of the first week, plus one of day eight being the you know next week. Sunny summer day! What's the, what's the weather tomorrow? Oh my god, it's actually gonna be sunny tomorrow. No way in hell. Oh, my luck's gonna be horrible though. The spirits are going all, they're going all out to take me down. Good luck, motherfuckers. Good luck. It'll take a lot more than that to bring Snippy down. All right, so now I gotta water all the crops. My favorite. Man, I really missed actually having to do farm work. <laughs> I mean, I love the rain, you know, but like the only op like optimal thing to do when it's raining is to fish. I, I mean, that's just how my brain operates. But now we're good. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do is take a trip to the hot spring and then uh, maybe we can go mining a little bit more and make some progress at our sweet copper pick. It'd be nice to get an iron one actually, but uh, I need more money for that. And the best way I get money right now is from fishing. No, no, no. No, no, no. That's not the only way I get money. It's just, it really just is the best way though. You know what I mean? Like until I have a solid animal farm built up. Does anyone have an extra carp? Marnie. Marnie, why do you want a carp? I don't, why the hell would you want that? Hey man, how you doing? I got any cool flooring or wallpapers? Okay, that's actually a pretty cool wallpaper. But I don't like wallpapers. Personally, I'm not a wallpaper guy. I'm more of a... I'm more of a... a wood plank guy. Here, Caroline, take this. You've been seeing wild fruits in the forest lately. Forging can be a fun way to earn some cash, or you can use them as gifts, like I just did with you. Hi, Abigail. You're an interesting guy, Snippy. I'm glad you moved here. That's... People don't usually mean that as a compliment. <laughs> Uh, let's, uh, let's go out there and start just digging through bushes with our hands. Uh, <laughs> case in point. <laughs> Wait, should I do this? I said I wanted to go mining, but... Ah, it doesn't hurt to have a stroll around, right? Come on. I, it's not like it's going to take all day anyway. Oh, would you look at that? This, oh, never mind. Oh, I don't know, actually. Wait, what is the deal with the... What is the deal with this tree? I don't have an axe. Something's up with that tree. I don't know what though. I thought maybe I had to break this to get in and I realized you can, that's just every bush you can do that. That's not special. That's not special at all. I do want to do some foraging though because I haven't I haven't been out here all that much. I do think that uh, Caroline was literally just talking about the spice berries by the way. I don't, I don't think she was actually talking about anything else. I think it's not until fall that we'll need to actually spend a lot of time out here. But I still decided to give it a look anyway, right? However, I think I've seen all I wanted to, so besides, you know, getting some of the sweet moss, we should probably head back and, and uh, go mining. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's go do that. Hey, Jazz, take this thing I found on the floor over there. Good luck. I'm here in the creepy zone again. Is anybody in here? 
No. It's only me, huh? I wonder if I, does anyone else even ever come here? I don't think so. Uh, I guess it's all I get to keep this all to myself then. Sweet, sweet resuscitation. I don't know if that's the right word. Whatever, you get what I mean. You know what sucks? It's already uh, noon. No, it's not. It's already almost evening, and I never gave Willy the topaz, which means I need to go do that before I go mining. That's fine. You know, five floors. That's progress. Hey, Willy, here's your topaz, man. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. Sorry that took so long. Um... Man, I can't go on legal mining now. Hi, Leo. What are you doing? Come, I come. I came for the sound of the ocean. Beautiful, isn't it? It is. Just don't drown in it. The ocean is no home of any human. <gasps> hey, Abigail. <laughs> I didn't get to say anything, so that was pretty awkward. <laughs> uh, hey, Sebastian. I'm looking forward to the cold, damp season. I feel more at home. Yeah, me too, right? Wait, no, it's not damp in the cold. It's damp in summer. Summer is damp, sweaty, and horrible. I hate summer. Also, good luck. But summer sucks. Who the fuck? I don't understand why you never like summer. It's so sweaty and horrible. Give me the cold any day. Now, let's try to go to floor 65 at the very least. Murder! Oh, what's that? Well, that's useful. All right, no, I'm not gonna do. A t I'm not gonna do a time skip this time. I'm not gonna do a time lapse this time. I I'm doing a time lapse of the farming anyway. That that's good enough. Let's just take it easy. Let's take it easy and maybe have a chat or something. I don't know. I mean, I really don't know what else. To I don't really have a super super big topic or anything. Uh, I, I guess I realize a lot. Uh, this game does start pretty slow. I mean, uh, I don't know about that actually. Because I'm currently there's a lot of lot of things that I need to be doing and saving up for and and all that. Did I just get two of these in the same? I two of those in a row. I only need one. I guess it's, uh... There, there is a few things. It's like, oh, you're gonna kind of have to wait for the, for the, for the, uh, next seasons to come. Actually, no, I don't think that's that big of a problem. If anything, it's... My problem is that all my progress has been fishing progress. <laughs> that's... If there's an issue to begin with, it'd be that. It'd be me for doing that and prioritizing that. I should probably be mining more than I am. But, I mean, to be fair, I mean, you know, I'm where my copper pickaxe is rated to be, so I think I'm okay now. It's just, I probably should have done this a few episodes ago. But alas, here I am. Hopefully we can get down to... We actually might get to 70 if I'm lucky, which would actually be really nice. But we'll find out. We'll see. We'll see if we can or not. Get down here, dum-dum. Get down here, you dum-dum. Alright, fine, don't. Stay over there. I don't care anyway. Hello, bats. Bats, man. Why? There's always bats. Every game. There's always bats. You know, I, I don't know if Stardew Valley had, like, an early access lifestyle. Or life. I don't know if it started out as some early access game that they perfected over time. Or if it just kind of dropped and they just started adding stuff to it. I actually don't know. It's, like, it's actually interesting because in a lot of games, I'm pretty, pretty well versed in the history of a lot of games that I play. For the, for, for, the, for the most part, but Stardew Valley, I actually have no idea. It's like a totally blank slate to me. It's just the game as I play it and I, as I perceive it, which is kind of cool in its own way that there, there is a, still a game out there, obviously, no shit, right? But like, there's a game out there that I can, I can kind of view that way, and it's not really weighed down by any of my own memories or expectations, right? Like stuff, something like Minecraft. <gasps> Diamonds! Diamonds! Speaking of Minecraft, that's actually really nice. Uh, that's actually very nice. But um, like the Minecraft, I have a lot of expectations and, and ideas already. Like, it's it's a game that I've been through a million times. You know, I've been through it for for, for a long for a long time. That it's hard not to like think about oh, all these memories and all these things that I've done and all these things that I've seen. And how long it's been, and how much everything has changed. I don't really have any of that to talk about with Stardew at all. Actually, literally at all. I think that's what kind of gives it a unique position to me, is that it's... It is a blank slate. It is something that I play, and it's like, this is... Yep, this is what I'm playing. There's nothing else to it. It's almost... I guess that's the thing with sandbox games in me, I guess. I usually know a lot about them. Like, Subnautica? I knew a lot about that game as it was coming out, because I followed its early access, right? Minecraft, Terraria... 
all of those, like I followed them throughout early access. I guess a lot of the other ones, like I guess something like Ark or whatever, I never really paid attention to. So I don't know. I still did with Rust and I don't really even pay attention to that game necessarily, but I still did follow that game's early development. And I still do remember stuff that's no longer in it. You know what I mean? So but with Stardew, again, it is a game that I really like and I'm really interested in that I don't know any of that stuff about. And I think that's... It's a little hard to remember. It's, 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 it's important to remember, I guess. You know what really sucks? It's 12 a.m. And I can't find any goddamn ladders. Come on! I wanted to get to 70! I'm so close! Where the hell is this ladder at? Oh, I gotta go. I gotta go home. Unless I want to use my warp totem. Oh, is it worth it? It's not worth it. It's just not worth it. Let's go home. It's not worth it. We we need to come back and do another mining day right after this anyway. It's It's not worth it. It's not worth it to stay that long, no. No, it ain't. Not at all. Uh, you know what sucks? I don't think I'm even gonna make it back anyway. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I gotta go straight to bed. I gotta go straight to bed. I gotta go straight to bed. I might make it. I might make it. I might make it. I might make it. Why does it look like I have a face? I might make it. All right, 30 seconds, 30 seconds, count the clock. I'm not putting a clock on streams. I don't actually don't, have, I don't know how to do that. And I don't feel like I'm gonna learn how in the next 40 minutes because that's when I'll be editing this. Come on, we gotta go. We gotta go. You know, snowmobile on W2, remember that? I made it. You know, you don't get done. I don't get my way, okay. Look at that. Got some pepper money. Actually, no, I got some mayonnaise money. The pepper was just there for show. Okay, well, you know, actually, that's not a bad amount of money for such a lackluster quote-unquote harvest because there was I didn't really harvest or sell much. I guess I am making a bit of cash. My copper axe is ready. Oh, we gotta go get that, don't we? Whoa, it's gonna be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the luau. The event will take place on the beach starting between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. We gotta go to the luau. Okay. Interesting. Dear Snippy, tomorrow we'll all be gathering at the beach for the annual Pelican Town Luau. The highlight of the event is the communal potluck. Make sure to bring something good to contribute. The governor himself is attending the event, so make sure you're on your best behavior. Come to the beach sometime between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. Mayor Lewis. <gasps> My melons are done! The melons are done! No, what? No, they're not. They're not done. They're not done. False alarm. They are not done. They aren't even I think they're still actually two days away damn it I, I fell for it Hey buddy, old pal, old Clint friend, you gave me my copper axe! Awesome, dude. That's really nice. Now I need to upgrade the hoe and uh, the trash can and we'll have all copper stuff. That's good. Hey man, you wanna give me a fire quartz? Oh, so close. What is that? Hellvite? So close! You almost gave me what I wanted. Alright. Ooh, what's that? Oh, pyrite! I recognize that. I remember that. Okay, I gotta keep one. All right, the rest is nothing new. Okay, that's that. I got some stuff for Gunther, and we can go mining all day this time. Oh yeah, I gotta go to the you know bath first, obviously. Here you go, buddy. Here's the Hellvite. Ooh, a reward. What's the reward, buddy? Oh, pumpkin seeds. I, you can just keep those for now, okay? I, I don't need to bring that home. You just, you hold on to those, okay? I'll get those when I need them. But I will need them. Why do I always, why do I do that? So I'm like menacingly. You know what I'm never doing? Checking the calendar. I guess I can do that before I head up there. That owl's smug and I don't like it. 
Luau, and then Bookseller is going to be here. Then there's a Trout Derby. Okay, I got to pay attention to the Bookseller uh, day after tomorrow. I guess I can give this to Maru. I don't know if she actually likes it, but it is her birthday, so she has to at least be grateful for the thought, right? Because I definitely thought hard about it. 100%. Maru, happy birthday! I thought I thought about you when I found this. Hey, what's this? A birthday gift? It's great. Thanks for remembering me. You No problem. Are you enjoying the season? Yeah. No, actually, I'm not. It's been so warm this year. Actually, you know what? I have been because there's been a lot of rainy days. And I do like them. But I also... Ah, hey, look. This is a nice summer day, right? It's a nice summer day. But I'm going to go underground and go mine instead. All right. Let's go. Goal is floor 70. Hey, a mystery rock. Topaz. Well... Too little, too late, bastard. I already got one. It would have been too late anyway, even if I did still need one. Hello, innocent creatures in your home. I'm Snippy. Oh god, no, what's this? Oh no, bad attack. They're coming! They're coming to get me! I'm too tired to even be, like, afraid anymore. I mean, I'm not really afraid of these things anyway, but... I just want to find the ladder! There's, like, three rocks left in this whole cave! Give me the ladder, you bat bastards! There's, like, five rocks- This is literally all the rocks left on screen right now. Come on, how unlucky can I be, man? Come on. This is only floor 66! I'm not even close! Give me a ladder! Let me guess, it's gonna be one of these ones. Oh my goodness, all the way at the start. Oh. oh. I mean, I'll take the gold, but where's the ladder, though? Where's the ladder? It's gonna be the first rock, watch. Nope, it's gonna be this one. Nope, it's gonna be this one. Nope, it's gonna be this one. Okay, these are literally the last rocks in the entire case. It's a 50 50. Okay. Alright. Okay. Yeah, sure. All right. Yeah, yeah, sure. I don't have any. I don't have any complaints. No, that's all good. All good. All fine. No problems from here. No problems here, guys. I'm not upset about that at all. No. Now you give me one right away. Well, I see how it is. Oh, now you give me nice music. I see how it is. You bastard caves. I just want to get out of these stupid ice caves. Wait. I was complaining about it being too hot outside. <gasps> Monster XP. Wait, it has a little thing on it. Does it mean I already read it? Oh shit, I already read that. I don't think that did anything for me. Damn it! Oh my god. Thank you, little dust fellas. See? These guys are the good ones. They give me ladders and coal and all sorts of stuff. They're the good ones. And they're easy to kill too. <gasps> I leveled up my mining. Good. I don't actually know what that'll give me, but... I can't say no to that. Hey, I'm on floor... 69. <laughs> and if you didn't unsubscribe yet, you just did. Hey, that's life, you know? That's life. That's the cost of making hilarious jokes. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, hardwood. That's actually nice, dude. Oh, combat boots. Hell yeah, get those on me. I'm a combat guy. Ooh, that's really cool. I like these. I like these gray boots. Oh, these are nice. Ooh, that looks nice. I'm a huge fan of these. Hey, a ladder. I'm, a, I'm, I'm happy. All right, floor 70. The master slingshot. Well, you may as well try to use it, right? All right, floor 70. This doesn't look like a cave anymore at all. They got like shackles and everything. What even are these? A crystal fabled to be the frozen tears of a yeti. They imprisoned yetis down here? That's a fucking skeleton. He's throwing bones at me. There's a skeleton in this game. Did they use stamina? Oh, no. This is just pretends to. Alright. Screw my ranged weapons. Oh, my God. They gave me a bone fragment. There's just there's skeletons in this world. Okay, they just have skeletons. Really. They... 
They have skeletons. They just walk around. They got skeletons. That's not good. That's not good at all. Can we call the cops? I feel like we need to call the authorities. This is not okay. You can't have skeletons walking around in your in the world. That's so bad. What are the implications of the Okay, so uh same damage, but it's faster and has more knockback. Ooh, that's Oh, this is a fine weapon. Oh, this is a fine weapon. Okay, let me eat these cave carrots. I know it's kind of a waste, but I I want to keep going and I need energy. This is such a cool sword. Oh my god. Oh, it's so cool. I mean, it's made out of a bone, stupid skeleton, but still it's really fast and it's like it looks really sharp and cool the only real question is will i ever find the ladder i did Ooh, look at this star room get it because the game's stardew valley okay these guys are actually formidable opponents i gotta say which is i don't i'm not proud to say but it's true oops that was a waste of stamina but it is, it is a true fact, okay? It's one of those true facts. But they, they kind of suck. I don't like them. I mean, I will thank them for giving me a cool sword, I guess. Like, immediately. That was pretty cool of them, but... You know. They're still kind of lame. Alright, I'm out of room, and that's bad. I don't need... How do I get wood down here? I don't even need that. I don't need that! I can get it from the surface. Now I just need to find out how to get down lower. And, again, it's the ladder dilemma. Hey, a ladder. Alright, one more, one more. One more, we get another- oh, Amethyst! Yeah! Oh yeah, baby, that's what I need. That's what I need more than anything. All right, I should have put that in a slingshot, but whatever. Die! 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 They're not so scary. How many people in this modern world, but they have like soda and like they go, you go fishing and stuff? They just, just skeletons underground. They there's, are there like conspiracy theories about this in this game? Like in this game's universe? Like guys, don't go underground. They're skeletons. Like do people think they're real or is it like, is it just me? Am I just crazy? Have I had this conversation before? Well, that would be proof of that, I guess. I don't want that. That's like the worst fertilizer in the whole game, except for the final one, which is actually kind of nice. If you don't mind the, you know, not, not having better fertilizer. All right, floor 75. I don't think I'm going to get to floor 80. Uh, with this little time left, so. Let's go home and have a rest. But hey, we're getting deeper in the mines, and that's nice. Let's uh, let's celebrate the Luau, why don't we? You know, I was gonna upgrade another tool today, and uh, it would have upgraded pretty quick, since the Luau would have pretty much skipped the day. Guess I won't do that. That's fine, I don't need to do that. What, what am I, some kind of meta slave? No, no, no. I don't always do the most effective thing possible every time, you know? It'd, bore, it'd be boring to do that. I know, firsthand. How boring that is. Can I break these yet? <gasps> I can get hardwood! We can get hardwood! We can get hardwood! We can get hardwood! All I needed was to get the second axe in the game. Why did I take so long to do that? I don't know, but it sucks and it's kind of lame. Okay, this is fantastic. One more batch. Two batch. Penny of time. And I'll be able to... I can do that one thing. I can do the community center thing. Hell yeah. All right. Let's celebrate the luau, why don't we? I wonder what ingredient, ingredient I'm going to bring. I do not know. Oh my god, I barely made it to bed in time. That was scary. <gasps> Level 5 mining! Choose a profession. Plus one ore per vein or chance for gems to appear in pairs. Okay, what sounds more intellectual? Okay, mining is probably one of the hardest jobs ever. It's probably... I, 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 I really... I feel, I feel like I really look up to this kind of job. Because you go in hell and, you know, breathe in all, sides of sh all kinds of shit. And you hit rocks. Um, but a geologist, oh, that just sounds so smart, you know what I mean, I was like, holy shit, this guy knows what a, what an amethyst is, this guy's fucking smart, dude, I'm picking that one, I forgot these are worth as much as they are, okay, nice, nice, it's here, 
Ah, oh, the luau! A celebration of something. Of <laughs> yummy food, I guess. Alright, what's it gonna be tomorrow? Sunny! It's a sunny summer, finally! And the spirits hate me every day. Starting tomorrow, an unusual amount of shells and corals are expected to watch up on beaches all around the world. I'm no scientist, but I've heard it's something to do with crab mating season. At any rate, you can make some good coin combing your local beach. Ah! That sounds awesome. That actually sounds quite delightful. Ooh, I can make a gold bar. Oh my god, I have so much iron! What the hell, dude? Oh my god! Okay, we gotta be smelting this, like, all day. Um, hello. Sorry, I'm not good at writing letters. I made one metal bar too many, and I thought you might need it. Clint the blacksmith. Hey, Clint, thanks for that! Iron bar, buddy, thank you! What a pal! What a pal! What a friend! Man, Clint's such a nice guy. Alright, so, our melons are a day away. I'm gonna wait to harvest the radishes till the melons are done. Uh, because I want everything to be in sync So we're gonna leave them as they are they won't go bad. I don't think god. I hope they don't <laughs> that'd be disappointing All right, it's watering time. I was this? Oh fuck. That was one of the radishes. God damn I was literally about to say oh is the hops done? No, it's not <laughs> What a dumb dumb I am Well uh, tomorrow the melons will be done so next video We're gonna have some melons to harvest and then replant That'll be nice. And Oshirochi. And Terry. And the water bowl. And Jerry. Alright, so. Ooh, there's the white large egg. Nice. We needed that for the uh, for the thing. Alright, so the day has come. It's the Luau. I have a few hours to go and prepare for that. And the unfortunate thing about all of it is I don't I don't know what to actually hand in. That's the problem, right? Uh, they, it's a potluck, which I didn't know what that meant when I first heard it, but, um, basically it's, they want me to give them a food item to add to the, uh, giant food of pot, pot of food that they have at the event. Oops! Well, there goes that. I'll find more. Who cares? <laughs> so, uh, huh. We're, we're gonna have to, uh, we're gonna have to figure out what we're gonna put in. Now, Ideally, it'd be something high quality, like this gold potato, and that actually might be what I do. But also, it's a potato, and potatoes aren't exactly the most, uh, you know, nice-tasting, elegant thing. But it is a pretty good quality potato, though. That's the thing. I mean, forget the fact that it's been here since spring. You know, ignore that. I could give them the octopus or something. Or some roe. That might add some flavor. If only I preserved them, though. Oh, damn it. Maybe that actually would have worked. I don't know. I don't know what they want me to put in there. I'm putting the potato in there. I This potato, I don't know why I even have this potato, but it's a gold star potato. That means it's going to be a gold star meal, okay? I know what I'm talking about. 100%. But before we go to the luau, I would like to hand in my hardwood. There you go. Oh, I need a 10, not 12. Boom, baby bundle complete. What's my reward? A charcoal kiln. I'll take it, I guess. Now I don't have to craft one. There you go, unknown spirits of an unknown force of an unknown kind. There's your construction bundle. I wonder what they're going to build with it. I don't know, but uh, that reward was okay, I guess. But it is good that we can start collecting hardwood because we will need it. Later on, we will need it. That's not food, man. I was hoping I'd get something for the potluck. Hey, Lewis. Uh, shouldn't you be down at the beach? Well, I'm about to be. Hi, Elliot. Yeah, I don't see you out here much. All right, here we go. Luau! Whoa. Look at this. How do you make carpets out of leaves? That's kind of impressive, actually. You know, I actually really like those. Hey there, Pierre. What are you selling? A star fruit? An extremely juicy fruit that grows in hot, humid weather. Slightly sweet with a sour undertone. That's 3,000?! <laughs> I'm sure it'll be worth it, guys. I'm sure it'll be worth it. You know, it's gotta be that expensive for a reason, right? It's not like... 
It's not like one of those scams where it's like, oh, you put in a $1,000? Trust us, you'll have 10000 in in two weeks. It's not like that, I think. Hi, Caroline. I put fresh vegetables from my garden in a communal soup pot. That's good to know. <laughs> Free buffet, one of the parks you're living here. Enjoy it, kid. I feel like you get that a lot of places, though. Hello, Marnie. If you brought something for the soup, climb the stairs on the other side and throw it in. All right. I could put this sweet pea in there. Ooh, I should have sampled it. Shit. I should have sampled this. Potato. Hi, Gus. These blasted sand flies keep landing on the food. God, I hate that stuff. I wish we could invent some way to communicate with bugs and tell them to fuck off. Just all, all the, the only words you need to translate is fuck off. That's it. That's all you're going to want to tell bugs is to fuck off. All right. Wow, you don't get hot pepper chutney like this in the big city. I don't know. Probably not. This is tiring, honey. Are you ready to visit the buffet soon? Pant. Oh, you stepped on my foot, dear. She's unresponsive. <laughs> I love Vincent. I'm bored. Vincent isn't a good dancer. You guys look like you're having fun. Hey, guys. How you doing? That music is too loud. Can I have a little peace and quiet to enjoy the ocean? Just come here another time if you want that. Ah, the smell of the ocean takes me back many years long before you were born. Yeah, probably. What nice music. Hello, Haley. I would dance, but I don't want to get sweaty. Fair enough. Perfect weather for a beach party, huh? Yeah, it's not raining for once. One year, Sam put a pound, pound of anchovies in a potluck soup. Jesus Christ. Ever wondered why Sam leads the town in community service hours? <laughs> that sounds like it's worse than prison. Hi, Abigail. It's tiring to socialize with everyone. I'd rather watch the sea. Yeah. I mean, you're just waiting around for food anyway, right? I guess. Hi, wizard. The mer people are curious about your festivities. They become upset when you litter into the ocean. If only I had that newspaper. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Wait, is that that creepy fuck that I saw in the water that one time? Abigail, if you look too long in the ocean, the, the, the uh, illusion will break. You'll see what horror it truly is. Hey, Willie. Hi, buddy. Hi there, Snippy. Taking a breather? Yeah. To tell you the truth, I'd rather be fishing right now. Yeah, me too, honestly. Time doesn't move on an event like this. Think of how many fish I can- think of how much fish I could get. Hey, Clint. I'm full, but what else is there to do besides eat? Yeah, I guess wait and eat. Good thing I came with sunscreen. I wonder if Mario could do some sunscreen on our shoulders. Uh, okay. <laughs> whatever- whatever Linus is roasting, uh, smells awfully good. A slow, continuous rotation is key to achieving the perfect roast. That's yeah, pretty cool, dude. I don't know what that thing is, though. I don't see any wildlife in Stardew Valley. What did you... What did you, uh... What is that? I don't... I don't know. We do this festival every year to give the governor a taste of everything the valley has to offer. Mayor Lewis hopes it will get the governor on her good side. That's why he's so neurotic about the way the soup tastes. Governor, who cares? Why should I care about some random old guy? Because he gives us money. It'll be... I'll be back here by the trees. The air is a lot cooler. That's good. How's the farming coming along? It must be a crazy season for you. Ah, uh, it's... I mean, yeah, it, it has. It really has. It's been a really tough few weeks. I woke up late, <laughs> stepped out of the door and found myself in the middle of all this hubbub. Yeah, I forgot that today was the luau. Yeah, you do live right here. Convenient. All right, I did it. I put my potato in. Let's get the hell, let's get the show on the road. It's the governor. What a lovely occasion. Oh, it's always a joy to visit Stardew Valley. I must speak to the missus about purchasing a vacation home here. Look, Shark, the governor's here for this annual visit. If you brought something for the potluck, make sure to add it to the soup cauldron. Shall we move on to forward with the luau? The governor seems a little hungry. Yeah, let's do it. I got a potato in there. Potato added. Ah, this is probably going to taste like garbage. Let's, let's, let's find out. I'm just going to watch way back here. Well, folks, it's time once again for the potluck ceremony. I trust that you all put high-quality ingredients in the pot this year. We don't want the governor to regret his visit to the valley. I put a potato. The most average, run-of-the-mill type of thing you could ever put. But at least it was a gold star one. Well, governor, would you do us the honor of tasting the soup? Of course. I've been looking forward to this all year. I'm not looking forward to this. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, 
Ah, oh, that's a very pleasant soup. The produce from this valley never disappoints. He liked it! What do you think, Lewis? Hmm, tasty. You all did very well today. Yay, we did a good thing! Now, who else wants some soup? I'm good, actually. I don't eat. The luau was a success. Good thing I brought something tasty for the soup. I did! Time to head home. Ah, oh, I knew that gold potato was gonna be worth it. I knew it! Ah, oh, wow, nice. What a way to cap it off. Ah! Caw, charcoal coal kiln! Oh! That's a gold mayonnaise! That's because I got it from the, uh, large egg, huh? Time to sample a sweet pea. I don't know what that did to me. I don't know what that did to me. I don't know what that did to me. Alright. I'm gonna put this here and I'm never gonna use it. It's gonna get thrown in the trash one day, I'm sure. We did it! I guess, if there's anything to be happy about. I mean, there is. What? That sounded depressing. What the fuck? I mean, I mean, like, out of... We did a good job of the luau, which is nice. And it'll be a nice sunny day tomorrow and a nice sunny summer. Let's try to get deeper underground and upgrade our tools some more and, uh... Oh, well, we gotta sort through all of our crops tomorrow, don't we? That'll all happen in the next episode. But until then, that's gonna do it for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did, I very much appreciate it. It means a lot. But until the next episode... You know I always come back and while I have been snippy... You know I'll see you around.